Hi, in this video I am going to show you in details how to set up alerts for MetaTrader indicators. How to set up application for your phone. How to get a MetaQuotes ID. How to use the MetaQuotes ID to receive alerts to your phone. Let's start. We are going to see how to set up different type of alerts for MetaTrader indicators. Pop-up windows. Sound alerts. Phone alerts. Email alerts. We will see real examples on how to do it with the kangaroo tail indicator. Same principles apply to any MetaTrader indicator. Just some definitions about the context before going into more details. We suppose that we use an indicator for MetaTrader and that this indicator displays arrows indicating buy and sell opportunities. We can call them buy and sell signals. Alerts indicate to user that a new signal was generated by the indicator. Alerts can be received as pop-up windows, sounds, phone messages, emails. With the use of alerts, there is no need to stay in front of the screen 100% of the time. Alerts are useful for traders monitoring multiple instruments and time frames. Alerts are also great to be kept updated while you are out of office. In this situation, you can receive push alerts to your phone. Alerts is indeed a great feature to monitor charts in real time, from any location, 24 hours per day. Let's start with pop-up and sound alerts. They are quite simple. Next we will jump to push alert settings. To have alerts working you must set use confirm signals to true. Then you have to enable the type of alerts you wish to use. For instance, pop up alerts to true. Or sound alerts to true. Depending on your own criteria. That's it. Let's see a real example with the kangaroo tail indicator. So. The first step is to set use confirm signals to true. Beware that for some other indicators, the name of the input to consider might be like use alerts. But same general principles apply. The second step is the choice of the type of alerts you want to use. For instance, pop up alerts to true. Or sound alerts to true. Depending on your needs. With the two simple steps we have seen, we are ready to receive alerts in our MetaTrader platform. Beware that to have alerts working fine we need both. Used confirm signals to true, and, the type of alerts you wish set to true. For instance pop-up alerts to true. Only setting pop-up alerts to true will not enable alerts. This is the most common issue users have with setting up alerts. Now, let's move to push alerts. In this situation, alerts are generated by MetaTrader on your computer and are sent to your mobile phone. You must have MetaTrader for iPhone or Android installed on your phone to receive push alerts. To receive alerts to your phone, you need a special configuration. First, you have to install MetaTrader for Android on your phone. Second, you must get a MetaQuotes ID. Third, you must set up MetaTrader to send notifications to your phone. And finally, you must enable alerts in the indicator settings. Let's go into more details about each step. Now, we are looking at the MetaTrader for Android installation process. You need to install MetaTrader for Android or iPhone. We will show you the steps for Android. First, open the Play Store on your phone. Then, search for MetaTrader 5 application. And finally, press the Install button to proceed. Now, the second step would be to get a MetaQuotes ID. The MetaQuotes ID is unique and is attached to the phone. We can generate the ID with MetaTrader for Android. Open MetaTrader 5 on your Android phone. Then click the MQID icon to get your personal MetaQuotes ID, as shown in our screenshot.
your MetaQuotes ID should now display on your phone. Keep a copy of this ID since you will need it to set up MetaTrader on your computer. The third step is to set up notifications on your computer. Let's see how to do it. Open MetaTrader on your computer. Go to the menu bar on the top of the application window. And then click the tools item in the menu bar. Finally, click the options item at the bottom of the menu list. The options model window should now display in MetaTrader. Select the notifications tab if it is not already selected. Now type in the MetaQuotes ID that you got earlier from your phone. Make sure that the Enable Push Notifications option is checked. Do not forget to send a test message to your phone. Press the test button for this purpose. If all was set up properly then you should receive the test notification to your phone. Please check your phone and make sure you did receive the test notification. If you did not receive it, then check that you did type in the correct MetaQuotes ID in the options window. Try again until you receive the test notification properly to your phone. The final step is the setting of the indicator so that alerts will be sent to your phone. Let's move to that step. You must set use confirm signals to true to allow alerts to be sent. Then you must specify the type of alerts you want to receive. In this case, you will have to set push alerts to true. That's it. Now you are ready to receive alerts to your phone each time a new signal is displayed in the chart of your computer. This video is almost over. We have seen how to enable the different types of alerts for your MetaTrader indicator. You can visit our online store. We offer more than 60 high quality indicators. Don't hesitate to contact us if you have any question. We are always here to help. This video is now over. Don't forget to give a like to the video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Receive our latest video updates, new products releases, special offers, business opportunities. Thanks for watching this video. Talk to you soon.